Approximately 20% of the population suffer from allergies where they have symptoms of frequent sneezing, nasal congestion, itchy or watery eyes, which are the typical hay fever symptoms associated with pollen allergies. People may have allergies to dust, mold and animal dander that cause year-round or perennial symptoms. The medical condition for seasonal and or perennial allergies is called allergic rhinitis and is one of the most frequent reasons why people visit their doctors. Besides causing miserable symptoms, allergies can cause illnesses such as sinus infections, bronchitis, asthma attacks, dizziness, chronic laryngitis, skin rashes, and hives. Billions of dollars are spent yearly in the United States alone for over-the-counter and prescription allergy medicines such as antihistamines and nasal steroid sprays. Indirect costs of time missed from work from allergies are in the billions as well. For many patients, taking allergy medicines alone or doing allergy avoidance is not enough to help them. Instead, allergy shots can help patients eliminate their symptoms. The process of receiving allergy shots is called immunotherapy, in which the same allergens that cause the patient's symptoms are mixed in vials and are administered into the subcutaneous tissue, either in the arm or thigh. These frequent vaccinations over time will produce special antibodies against the allergens that block the cascade of allergic reaction from starting. Immunotherapy is meant to be a long-term cure. However, allergy shots require frequent visits to the physician's office to receive the injections, which can be a challenge for most people's schedule. Now there's an effective method to treat allergies without shots called sublingual immunotherapy, or SLIT for short. SLIT is a method of allergy treatment that uses an allergen solution given under the tongue, which, over the course of treatment, reduces sensitivity to allergens. It's as simple as pressing this pump three times to deliver three drops under the tongue. SLIT can be used to treat both airborne and chronic non-severe food allergies. Examples of airborne allergies are tree, grass, and weed pollens, dust mites, molds, feather, and animal dander. The treatment is done daily at home and only takes 20 seconds to do. It's indicated for both adults and children. SLIT has been used for over 60 years and is especially popular in Europe. Some countries such as England primarily use SLIT as the method of allergy desensitization. To learn more, we went to Piedmont Ear, Nose, Throat and Related Allergy, or PENTRA for short, located in Atlanta. The doctors at PENTRA are experts in treating allergic disorders. When a patient arrives at their office, their staff treats the patients with kindness and respect. The patients are first seen by a physician where a thorough allergy history and physical exam are done. The patient undergoes an allergy evaluation, usually by a skin test, where tiny needles with different allergens are placed barely under the skin along the upper arms. After 10 minutes, the skin where the needles were placed is evaluated for a wheel, which is a round, elevated swelling of the skin. The wheels represent an allergic response to the test allergen. The physician then goes over the results of the allergy skin test with the patient and treatment options are discussed. If the patient is allergic to dust mites or molds, environmental controls would help decrease their exposures. HEPA filters are special air cleaners that filter out more than 99% of allergens such as dust. Antihistamines and nasal steroid sprays may be prescribed as well. Allergy avoidance and allergy medications can really help the patient's symptoms, but they don't cure it for good. If the patient stops doing environmental controls or their medications, their symptoms would probably return. In contrast, allergy desensitization with either conventional allergy shots or SLIT is meant to cure the patient after the treatment is completed. We asked Dr. Kingsley Chin, who's been treating patients with SLIT for years. The real advantage of SLIT is that it is more convenient than traditional allergy shots, easy to do, safer, and most of the time cheaper. Typically, a patient receives their injection in a doctor's office and has to wait 20 to 30 minutes to make sure there are not any adverse reactions from the shots. Every time the patient comes in, the dose of the injection is increased until maintenance is reached. With SLIT, there's no ramp up period and patients are shown once how to use it and they do the rest at home daily. The process of doing slit is just pressing the pump on the special bottle where a drop is delivered under the tongue. The patient holds the solution for, there for 20 seconds and then swallows it. Typically, a patient uses one to three drops daily. Patients receiving allergy injections usually require between two to four vials, which could translate into four separate shots each time. With slit, 
the allergens can be mixed together most of the time in only one vial. Most importantly, allergy drops are a safe, effective treatment for young children, asthmatics, the highly reactive, and those with underlying medical conditions that prevent them from being candidates for injection therapy. It's extremely rare to have serious reactions such as anaphylaxis, which is swelling of the throat from slit. One of the problems with allergy shots is that when patients are sick, they're advised not to take an allergy injection since there's a higher chance of developing an adverse reaction when ill. If patients are unable to do their allergy shots on a regular basis, whether it's from illness, vacation times, or being too busy to come in, their progress is hindered. With slit, patients typically do not fall behind in their progress. Slit has very infrequent side effects. Some patients may complain of itching in their mouth, and since the drops are swallowed, some patients may have gastrointestinal symptoms. In the United States, slit is not covered by most health insurance carriers because the Federal Food and Drug Administration has not approved it. However, in the 1990s, the World Health Organization approved slit as a safe and effective method in providing allergy treatment. Nevertheless, the cost of slit is probably cheaper than the cost for frequent visits to the doctor's office for allergy injections. Besides the lost wages from missing work, there are the costs of gasoline and parking that need to be added to the expenses. Patients are usually on allergy injections for three to five years. The same holds true for slit. At Piedmont Ear, Nose, Throat, and Related Allergy, the doctors will evaluate your allergy condition and will educate and treat you to eliminate your allergy symptoms. Make sure you discuss your allergy problems with your doctor today.